As your system grows bigger and bigger, there is a possibility of having loopholes where, for instance, a document like a delivery note can be used multiple times to pick goods from your warehouses. When I say delivery note, uh, of course now that can trickle into other documents like uh, like purchase orders and all those kind of things sales orders and the rest now today i would like to show you uh, the kind of a security feature that we have built for delivery note so let me go here i said to delivery note and here i have a number just you know this let's just go ahead and create ours now when i create a new delivery here let me just select a random customer and I enter my item here as tires and say these are five and each of them costs maybe 23,000 Kenya shillings and then I save it now when I save this if I look at the print format this is the standard print format only that I just removed a few things here but and of course there is draft there here when we submit the document more happens for example what uh, I'm talking about is we are going to append a QR code here that is going to contain information like the company that is the company that uh, this uh, delivery note was dra uh, drawn from the user who was logged in and did this delivery note and the timestamp when this was done and in addition to that we are going to have other information and let me show you let me go back here and let me go ahead and now submit this delivery note so when I confirm yes that I want to submit looks like nothing much happened but now when I look at the print format, look at this. So here we have a QR code. This QR code down here also has a, a line that says, scan the QR code or click here to validate. Now when I click on this, let me just right click and uh, click on here. Go to this. And it has information there. So this information says something like all that. Let me just copy this as is. Let me show you. Copy. And then I take it to Postman here and paste and click on next and you can see this is what happens this gives me status success data is Ubisoft limited that's the company user was administrator timestamp is this time and you can check up here you see this is the time now all right this is my time now currently and the dev delivery note itself is also appended there and down here we also have the link to the delivery note so all that information is appended into this QR code and therefore what this tells you is that you can use this information to validate whether the QR code that is on the document actually exists therefore you cannot have people manufacturing delivery notes from somewhere and sending them to your stores people your stores people will just receive the document and they validate the QR code also you cannot have multiple QR codes for one delivery note and then of course what you are going to do here is probably to do um, a print so that every when you print this document for the first time it's going to go well uh, of, of course without any 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 kind of printed but when you do a second time you can just add a um, a, a big font here that says duplicate so that way your goods are safe and they can only leave the stores when they are supposed to leave the stores of course you can duplicate this functionality to uh, suit your specific need and we can help you with that if you have such a need don't forget or don't hesitate to go to opelsoft.com and write to us here so this is opelsoft.com or if you also want any other kind of advice regarding how you can safeguard and make sure that your system is safe don't again hesitate to write to us on the contact us page and we are going to be happy to assist you all the best in your frappe here up next software journey